Dr. Paul here. We've got a young man with a rash. Let's go take a look. Knock, knock. Hello. Well, my goodness, we used to have a patient in here. <laughs> Where could he have gone? Not there. Oh, I see yeah. you. <laughs> are you a good climber? Yeah. I bet you are. If you, if I pull out that step, you think you could make it up there? Yeah. Yep. Oh, oh, easy peasy. <laughs> You're a great climber. Uh huh. Uh huh. I can almost like climb on anything. Can you really? Yeah, but not in a house. The edge of the house, that would really hold me if I fall. You could be like Superman or leap tall buildings with and a single jump, bound. And Just then jump you... up. Yeah, and then I fly <laughs> down. Okay. I hear you You have a rash. Is that right? You do? Okay. And this rash started where? It started from here and then it went down. That's... Like this. Ah! <laughs> okay, so it started on your cheeks, right? Let me get my light. So your rash started on your cheeks. <laughs> <laughs> yep. So I had it when I'm done. Yeah. Okay. okay. So so it started on your cheeks, and then you said it moved to your arms. Was it on the cheeks about five days ago? Four or five days uh, yeah. 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 Four or five days. Okay. And then we've got it on your arms. And that just appeared. And that just started today. A little closer. Mm -hmm. Okay. So we've got, when I push on it, it disappears for a minute, and then it comes right back. Right back. Yep. Oh, it's fine. And we got it. Oh, look, there's a whole big old blotch. Oops. Sorry. Big old blotch on your arm. Let's do the shining thing. Or let's do the. So we push on it there and it disappears and it comes right back. Look at that. <laughs> it's ma it's, it's a like ma magic. It's like a magic <laughs> rash. And then do you have it on your tummy? Can we look? Just barely, maybe. <laughs> <laughs> let's see your other arm. You like doing that too? <laughs> All right, I've already examined this young man and everything else is perfect. I mean, his ears couldn't be better, his throat couldn't be better, his lungs, his heart, everything. We just have this story of a rash. This is a classic slap cheeks equals fifths disease. <laughs> Why did they call it fifths disease? <laughs> Somebody on YouTube will tell us. I think I've heard, but I'm just a doctor. How would I know? I've heard that they had first, second, third, <laughs> fourth, and then they ran out of names. Measles, mumps, rubella, rubiola. <laughs> and then it was like, ah, we'll just call this one the fifth one. That's so silly. <laughs> anyway, this is harmless viral Why infection. Why you cut off your finger? I'm telling you, it's silly. <laughs> harmless viral infection. Thought you might want to see a classic case. It's a perfect story. Starts with the cheeks, spreads usually to the arms, maybe the legs, occasionally a little bit on the trunk. Blanching rash. Kids are usually well. You don't even have to be excluded from school generally, although check with your kid's school or daycare. And um, there you have it. Case of fifth disease. I'm Dr. Paul. Thanks for watching. What do you like to tell your fans on YouTube? I think you should just tell them, keep on laughing. <laughs> right? Keep on doing it. <laughs> All right, you're a ham bone. Here, you want to get down? Yeah. All right. Whoa! There you go. Oh, whoa, whoa. Feet down. There you, you go. Can you hide now? You can hide. Don't look at me, okay? okay no look. one looks at me. Okay, we're not looking. Wonder where he went. Wonder where look he went. Again, look again. Look again. He's gone. Wait a minute. There you are. <laughs>